Hello chess lovers! 2018 Batumi Chess Olympiad is full of dramatic games where mating several moves already can surprise no one. But when grandmasters can get a lost position in a few moves, this is already shocking. Now let's have a look at a game played between Spanish chess player Manuel Perez Candelario and Algerian chess player Ayman Rizuk, where Algerian grandmaster got a lost position after his seventh move. Perez Candelario started the game with e4 and black went for one of the oldest recorded openings, Scandinavian defense d5. He takes d5, queen takes d5, knight c3, queen a5, bishop c4, knight f6, d3, c6, queen e2, bishop f5. Of course, all this is a standard stuff seen many times. Both players are simply developing their pieces, bishop d2, and a terrible mistake by Algerian grandmaster, knight d7. Well, usually when white is playing bishop d2, then black is moving away his queen from this dangerous diagonal to c7 square. In this case, after bishop d2, e6 was also playable, but in the game after bishop d2, we see this terrible knight d7 move, after which white made a move and black's position is lost. Can you find the winning move for white? Ready? Well... Perez Candelario simply played knight b5 and black is in trouble. With his last move, white attacked black queen, took under control this essential c7 square and is threatening knight d6 check and the knight takes f7. For example, if queen d8, then black king can even get checkmated. Or after knight b5, if queen b6, then knight d6 check and the knight takes f7 fork finishes up black. In the game after knight b5, black could actually resign but decided not to lose in 8 moves and still made some more desperate moves. Queen takes d2, check, queen takes d2, c takes b5, bishop takes b5, a6, bishop takes d7, check, bishop takes d7, knight f3, bishop c6, black has only 2 bishops against the queen and a pawn and that gives black no chance to survive. Queen f4, black castles queen side, and now comes the knight, knight e5. Bishop takes g2, rook g1, bishop d5, and finally black resigned. The thing is that now white can play c4, and if bishop e6, then d4, and then d5 is coming, there is always this threat. That's why understanding all that, finally after bishop d5, Algerian Grandmaster Ayman Rizuk resigned. A very painful loss, I think. This was definitely a huge disappointment for Ayman Rizuk. Thanks for watching. Here are more suggestions for you. For more games, consider subscribing to my channel. I will see you in the next video.